we'll just put the coffee on the side. And here's our orange crepe, or crepe chisette, and our affogato. Hello and welcome to Goma at Home. Today we are making uh, orange crepes and affogato. Yeah, and perfect talaga for the for the outdoors. So, yung uh, paggawa natin ng crepe is very simple. No, it's just uh, it's just uh, flour. Prepare one cup of flour, put a little sugar, and this teaspoon of sugar would be good, and then just a little salt. A pinch of salt, yun, yun lang, and then we'll put in our milk and butter. Tapos alagyan natin ng two eggs. Okay, two eggs. There you go. One, two. And since ma marami marami yung flour natin, I'll make it three eggs para very rich on natin yung uh, butter natin. I'll put in a little. Uh, Melted butter, there you go, good. And a little milk. There. So what you do, you mix mo muna siya. No? And then, dahan dahan lang. Dahan dahan. Until mag incorporate yung, yung mga liquid in the flour. Mix it. Hanggang mag incorporate na lahat. And then slowly, you'll add in more milk. What you want na butter is yung uh, very thin na butter. No? Ayaw mo na makapal. Because when you make crepes, pag nilagay mo na sa, sa pan mo, gusto mo na medyo, medyo malambot siya, very thin, no watery, ganun ang texture niya. See? And then just mix it well. You know? So, kita, kita mo to, that, that's very thick. No? I'll add a little more butter. A little more butter, there you go. Good. Very nice. Hmm? And then, pag, pag na-mix mo na siya na mabuti, tapos wala na siya mga buo-buo. Hmm. Good. Pwede mo siya slowly lagyan ng, what, ng uh, milk or let. Again, then mix it. Nga sa maging watery siya. Yan, ganun lang. Just like that. Okay? So, ganun lang yung paggawa ng butter niya. Okay? And then, kumpi pa. Yan. And every once in a while, while you're cooking, what you want to do is to uh, keep on mixing it para makita mo yung, yung butter mo. Ano? Talagang... Uh, Mix to well siya. Tapos hindi siya nagbubuo-buo. There. Good. Nice. Alright. Once you're done, tabi na natin to. I'll put it there. Para occasionally, halo-haloin natin siya. So, I'm done with my, uh, I'm done with my milk. I'll use my sugar in a while. Okay na ako sa eggs ko. Tatabi ko na ito. Okay. Next, gagawin na natin yung ating crepes. You, know. you have to be very careful na hindi masyado mainit yun mo yung, uh, yung pan mo. No? Kasi masusunog siya. Eh. And then, it's best to use a uh, non-stick pan. So, if you don't have this kind of crepe pan, you can also use this, basta non-stick siya. Okay? And then usually, yung mga first, first two na, na crepe mo, ano yan eh, do kasi medyo malamig pa yung, yung, yung pan. So, hindi pa maganda masyado yung luto nun. It only becomes better on the third and then the succeeding uh, crepes. Okay? And then, pang measure natin, isang ganito lang. You know? Just like that. Pag sa tingin nyo medyo, ano pa siya, medyo uh, makapal pa. Add a little uh, water. 
It's like this. Yan, ganyan lang, oh. Add mo lang ka ng water, and then, i-mix mo ulit siya. Ano? Zoom mo. Okay. At first, uh, crepe. So this will put little butter. Boom. Yun lang. So I put a little bit butter. Then I give a little butter dito. Yun. Yun lang. Yeah. Okay. And then we'll mix this. We now make our crepe. Okay. Yeah. There we go. That's what you want. Spread it all over. Yung. See? Spread it all over. Done. And then just let it brown. We'll cook the other side first. Then, pagbalit natin, give it a few seconds. We're ready to make the next one. Then, and then, later on, bubble karen natin sa. There you go. Nice. Give it a few seconds, then luto na yan. If we can make around mga 10 crepes or 8, and then we'll make the sauce, then we're good. Okay, good. Good, see? Ganda. Nice color. Perfect. Okay, then we move it here. Yan. Natan nyo lang na hindi siya ma mapunit. Okay, careful. Oh, it's very thin. Tama yan. Dapat ganun ka lang kasi nagka-thin. Repeat the whole process. Just grab in some butter. Okay. There you go. All over. And then... We'll put in our mixture. Okay, just like that. And then, buhos all over. Good. Then, let it cook. Ganun lang. Ano lang ka, kasa yun. Now that our crepes are done, gagawin naman natin yung pinaka sauce niya. Alright? So, what you want to do is, kun natin yung, uh, yung rind ng ano ng orange you want to you want to get all of this kasi yun lahat ng flavor nyan no? yan no? yan lang no? yung orange part lang ha pag mong kukunin yung white part kasi mapakla na yun yan no? hanggang dyan ka lang there see that? there you go you get orange juice pigayin natin sya dito there you go Okay, we'll use the juice. Use it to make a sauce. Okay, here you go. That's all we need. Now at this point, we are going to make our sauce for the crepe. That makes it uh, crepe sauceette. Now we'll make our, uh, our sauce using sugar. Grand Marnay and butter. Okay, we'll put in our butter first. There. Wow. Okay. So we'll melt our, bu our butter. There you go. Nice. Nice. Yeah. We we'll lower the temperature. Okay. Just let it melt. And then we we'll put in some sugar. Put in, uh, Two tablespoons of sugar, and this is we put in our orange juice. There, we we'll put in our orange rind. Yeah, good. And we'll mix it until it becomes a sauce. Once the uh, sugar is melted, we'll put in our uh, our crepes. All right. 
I'm going to prepare the crepes. We'll fold it. There you go. Two fours. Fold it. Then we have our sauce. Let's try our sauce. How it's coming along? Okay. Sugar's melted. Mmm. Oh, fantastic. Really good. At this point, we'll put in some uh, some Grand Marnier no? to add more flavor, add more body. There. And then you can flambe it. But during the day, hindi mo siya makikita. So, see, you know, you can feel it. May in it. So, we'll let the alcohol evaporate. And then we'll put in our whew, our crepes. Lower the fire. Then still in flambe. There, we're in flambe. Okay, good. Slowly put in our crepe. There you go. See how beautiful the colors are. Nice. And then the crepe is absorbing all the sauce. Yun. Nice. Good. So we'll put this in our plate. Serve natin siya. Nice one. That's the remaining crepes. Pero pa siyang sauce doon. Put it there. Put it there. Good. And so, and there you go. That's your crepes. And then your sauce. And some more sauce. Nice. Okay. Next is we'll make coffee. Ah, uh, uh, fogato. We'll make espresso coffee. For me, this is the best. The best espresso maker. Okay. Fill it up with coffee. That's it. And then. Alagyan ng water. Punin na ng water. And then, drop this in. And seal the top. So, what's going to happen? Pag, pag kulo niya, look at this, pag kulo niya dito, lahat ng coffee papasok doon. There you go. Huh? So give it about two minutes, then we have our espresso. Okay. Then our coffee is done. Okay, to make our affogato. Oh, there you go. Nice. Soft ice cream. No? That's a in it. Oh, no. Yes. There. Put in one scoop. Then another one. Yes. There. 
Okay? Para mawakan natin mabuti. Yan. Okay? Then just put the coffee on the side. Just like that. Yeah. Just like that. That's your affogato. That is your affogato. Nice. Nice. And then, in a container, orange. Oh, beauty. And here's our orange crepe or crepe Suzette and our affogato. All right, let's try this. First, yung crepe natin. Oh, so, and yeah, soft. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Come on. Hmm. Hmm. sa Paris. Ganun lang. Then our affogato. Hot espresso with vanilla ice cream. Then pin up natin with uh, orange rain. Hmm. Wow. Let's mix it. And take a sip. The meat, very good. Perfect with them. Hmm. Perfect with our crepes. One more. There you go. Last. Hmm. Woo. Hmm. I like it. It's not too sweet. Soft and texture of crepe, and then. The butter is so rich. Wow. Shut up. Hmm. Thank you so much for uh, sharing your time with me. So here's your crepe set and affogato. You can do this in your kitchen, share it with your friends, enjoy it with your family. Please like, subscribe, and do not forget to press on the notification bell para alam nyo pag meron tayong bagong video na lalabas. Alright? So again, thank you so much for staying with me right here in Gomez. This is Richard Gomez. I'll see you again sometime. Bye.